Mandatory evacuation remains in effect for the entire San Bernardino County town of Forest Falls because of a fire there. The area was also hit today with torrential rain and mudslides. CBS 2's Jeff Nguyen is live in the middle of it all. He joins us with a look at the conditions now. Jeff? Well, this is the command post, and it is the only spot where we're able to send a live signal to you. This fire is actually burning on the other side of the hills behind us, where you can see a little bit of smoke right now. That area is very steep and rugged. Earlier, it rained in there, and that led to a muddy mess. Check out cell phone video of this mudslide on Highway 38 between Forest Falls and Angeles Oaks in San Bernardino County. U.S. Forest Service Captain Ernesto Rubio captured these images of rain and hail after he moved his crew out of harm's way while they were battling the valley fire. We had thunderstorms that were coming overhead, so we were pulling everybody off the line. You can see how quickly the mud piled up in some spots about 10 to 12 feet. This flash flood warning was sent to phones in the area, but Captain Rubio says his team got the heads up well before that thanks to the aircraft above. Flash flood warning came about 10 minutes after it actually came through. The Valley Fire broke out yesterday afternoon and it led to a mandatory evacuation order in the town of Forest Falls. <laughs> Willie Ross and his boss were just a few who stayed put. We work for the water company, so we decided to stay just in case, you know, someone need to, you know, operate the system or something. An aerial bucket brigade has been drawing water from this lake. But the true heavy lifting is being done by hand crews cutting lines the old-fashioned way. Talking about boots on the ground, hiking up. Yep, absolutely. It's unclear when the back-breaking work will end because we found flare-ups like this after the rain fell. It kind of uh, gives you a sense of false hope as far as, um, you know, right now things are calm, but give it a couple days for the sun to poke its head again. And So far, about 1,000 acres have burned and containment is at 5%. At this point, it is unclear when the mandatory evacuation order will be lifted. For now, we are live in Yucaipa. Jeff Nguyen, CBS2 News.